I know one thing's for sure. I'm definitely glad I don't live in a city where this guy is on the police force. Now before we begin, I have to add that this conspiracy has nothing to do with the live action movie. I know, I know, we all love Matthew Broderick. So get this, is Inspector Gadget really the evil Dr. Claw? Inspector Gadget was an Inspector Clouseau meets Robocop cyborg policeman that graced our Saturday morning cartoon lineup in the 80s. But this is what one conspiracy states. Dr. Claw, Inspector Gadget's arch nemesis, is actually the real Inspector Gadget. The main character of the Inspector Gadget series is actually a robot duplicate of the man Dr. Claw once was. The man he used to be was in a terrible explosion while on the job, causing his friends and family to think him dead. This is where his clever niece Penny comes in. In her grief, she recreated her uncle as a crime-fighting robot, not knowing that her real uncle was still alive. Now Claw wants revenge on the machine that replaced him. If you really think about it, this theory fills in a lot of the gaps that the show left out. We never see Claw face and all we know him by is a metal hand and a garbage disposal like voice. So could this really be true? Well, this seems to pan out pretty well. Oh, but there's one thing I forgot. Six years after the show went off the air, they actually released a Dr. Claw action figure that was more than just a metal hand and a chair. They even put a sticker over his face so you couldn't see his face unless you bought the toy. And if you did buy it, you got to see this. Yeah, that's not Inspector Gadget. Who is that guy? In fact, they also showed this same face in the Inspector Gadget Super Nintendo game released in 1993 and the iPhone game that was released last year. It sounds like a really cool theory, but there's just too much that disproves it. So I guess I'm gonna have to give the Inspector Gadget Dr. Claw conspiracy one claw out of five. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of Cartoon Conspiracy. If you agree or disagree with my debunking of the conspiracy, let me know in the comments. If you want to check out any of the links we reference in this video, look in the description. Click over here for a preview for next week's video, but make sure you subscribe to Channel Fred Raider, and I'll see you guys next week.